Understanding, Reckon the Chances, A Guide to Mastering English Phrases. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that you might come across in conversations, books, or movies, Reckon the Chances. Understanding this phrase will not only enhance your English vocabulary but also improve your comprehension of context and nuances in English dialogues. Let's explore what it means, how to use it, and some examples to clarify its usage. Stay tuned to master this interesting expression. First, let's break down the phrase, reckon the chances, into two parts. The word, Reckon is a verb that means to believe, think, or consider. It's a more informal way of saying estimate or calculate, often used in British English but understood widely. The word chances refers to the possibilities or likelihood of something happening. When combined, reckon the chances means to assess or evaluate the likelihood of an event or outcome. It's often used when someone is trying to make a guess or an informed prediction about something uncertain. Now that we understand what reckon the chances means, let's look at some examples to see how it's used in sentences. Do you reckon the chances are high that we'll win the match tomorrow? Here, someone is asking for an opinion on the likelihood of winning a game. I reckon the chances of rain are pretty low today, despite the clouds. This sentence expresses an assessment of the weather conditions. Using, reckon the chances, in conversations shows not only your ability to make predictions but also your proficiency in using English in a more natural and nuanced way. To get comfortable with, reckon the chances, Try incorporating it into your daily conversations or writing exercises. Here are a few prompts to get you started. Discuss with a friend about the likelihood of a favorite team winning a championship. Write a short paragraph predicting the outcome of an upcoming event, using, reckon the chances. The more you practice, the more natural it will feel to use this phrase in your English communications. Congratulations, you've just expanded your English vocabulary and learned how to use the phrase, reckon the chances, effectively. Remember, language learning is a journey filled with new discoveries at every turn. We hope this video has been helpful in your English learning adventure. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content. See you in our next video, and keep practicing.